hey friends welcome back so um, this uh, quick nuggets what we need to have is a form tags okay so I'm gonna have I have my uh, opening form tag and then the closing form tags and in here I'm gonna have to have a P tag I have my username and then input tag uh, type is going to be a text name it's gonna be username class of input value placeholder and our username Okay, and I will need to copy these two lines of codes and go into paste in here. I'm going to change this to password. And then enter your password. Okay, let me go ahead and save this and uh, check our... Okay, so I have here uh, username and then the password. Okay, so if I type username, you can see the full text Ryan, and for the password, let's say one, two, three, you can see the, the, the text as well. Now, this is not what happened. I mean, you want you don't want to like show your password, maybe someone might see it. Okay, so in order for you to hide your password, make sure that make sure that your type is not a text but it should be a password okay and also we need to since you can see that the form is not inside the main wrapper we need to include this form inside our dev like that okay control s and let's see Okay, all right. Now let's style our uh, these two text text field. So it's gonna be um, its class is input value, right? So let's have input value first. Um, we know exactly that the width of our main wrapper is 600 so let's have let's have a width of 400 and then the padding of 2 pixels let's save this and let's check it out okay now let's remove the borders of our input tag so border it's gonna be none uh, let's save this okay let's remove the border and then let's have a border uh, bottom okay one pixels and then that's gonna be zo solid and let's look for another um, image or, or picture this one or maybe this green okay color is going to be white text align center and let's save this okay And let's have background transparent. Save this. Okay. Let's change the color of this main wrapper. Um,
Okay. There we go. Now, notice that our main wrapper is actually it's we, we want it to have a space right here because we don't want our main wrapper to sit right on top or right like zero so we need to have a space right here so let's um, I'm gonna have to put margin top 20 pixels okay now the next thing that we need to do is for our submit uh, button I think we don't have submit button so let's have a button right here and that's gonna be inside form so that's input type this time it's going to be submit and then name class submit btn the value is basically uh, the text that you can see on the button itself so we have a button now now let's cut this in display button below our um, input field for the password and let's have let's add a break right here okay okay now let's add a style on our button and again that's submit btn margin top that's going to be 20 pixels so see and then width of going to be 400 pixels the height 40 pixels and then color it's going to be white let's change the submit button into color uh, green oh. um, text font size 24 pixels let's see okay 24 pixels now let's have a hover effects so I'm gonna have to copy this hover Let's have the red, this one, and then color is going to be white. Let's see. See? Okay. So, guys, uh, this is my basic login form in purely HTML and CSS. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more video updates. Thank you.